Welcome people from Earth and beyond. Today I will be showing you on how to install a custom ROM on the Samsung Galaxy Gear 2 or Neo. <coughs> so as you can see right now, I'm on custom ROM Android Wear 5.0, but I'm not quite satisfied with it since it doesn't let me play sounds. So I'm going back to Tizen, but not to Tizen, I'm going back to Tizen Mod. And right now, I'll show you how to do that. So the first thing you need to do is go into recovery mode. So long press the home button until your screen goes into the restarting, rebooting. And then you, pre you keep pressing the home button. And then this little thing shows up. You can't probably really see that because my phone isn't the best at recording small print. Whoa! There. Okay, so as I said, you long press, you long press the home button, then start clicking, and then go into the download. And to actually go into it, you have to long press, and there it is. It's in download right now. That's custom download mode I have right there. So now what you're going to need to do is get your USB cable. And get your watch dock or whatever you want to call it. I call it a dock, but it's not really a dock because it's not a docking station. Input there. So people, now we're on the computer, and what these are the two files you're gonna need: Odin and Tizen. Full restore. Now I can't take credit for these files because I obviously didn't make them, and I'm pretty sure most of you have used Odin before. So if you have you should know that first you need to extract it and then you can delete the normal file then you go in open it up and you pick AP and you wait and then you pick the Tizen full restore now it's the first time I'm seeing these but I know what these are Options, you need to have auto reboot and every set time on. You cannot have repartition on. And then you just press. Molly, get off my desk! How did you even get there?
then the gear will restart. It will restart multiple times until you get a black screen. You have to wait quite a while before you're sure that it is the black screen. But when you are sure, like I am right now, you can take the watch, hold it again, wait till it shows the rebooting menu, double or whatever click, go into recovery, hold. And that which should reboot, reboot normally. If my dog doesn't eat the cable before that happens. As you can see, that was the second screen, and there we go. Now you know it has worked. Now you will see the Tizen logo. Come up, swirl around, and your system should turn on. And there you go. So that's how to restore Android Wear back to Tizen. Not only, that's how you install every single ROM. So in the description, I will leave Tizen Mod 1, Tizen Mod 2, Tizen Mod 3. I'll also leave Android Wear. So, thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. See you again in my next video. Peace out.